Yeah, good afternoon. Uh, I'll be shortly speaking about about the complications of the diabetes. We all know very well that uh, how dreaded disease disease and uh, how much complications does it cause. Basically, we divide uh, complications of the diabetes into two, which is the microvascular complication and the macrovascular complications. So, microvascular complications, as we all know, affect the cardiovascular system, the brain, the peripheral vascular disease and the microvascular complications mainly reflect the neuropathy which cause neuropathy, retinopathy and the nephropathy. It is very very essential to have a good control of diabetes to prevent the complications. We know very well that there is a stage of a pre-diabetes before the diabetes and it has been well established that the complications of the diabetes start even in a pre-diabetes stage. So whenever a patient is not fully diagnosed as a pre-diabetes, as a diabetic patient, and even if he is in a pre-diabetic state, which we can very well diagnose by the blood sugar parameter and by the HB1A1C parameter. So if the patient is in a pre-diabetic stage, he should understand that how important it is not allow it to progress into the diabetic state so that its complication can further worsen. So it's very, very necessary to have a very, very good glycemic control to prevent the complication and to prevent the further uh, deterioration of the complications. So I advise everybody to remain away from the diabetes in the sense that if you are in a pre-diabetic state, try best not to enter into the diabetic state and if at all you have gone into diabetes, they try to prevent your complication as early as possible by preventing a good glycemic control. Thank you. Thank you very much.